giving giving tickets to a homeless person it it, it only eliminates their chances of getting housing because if you have a warrant or a conviction for a misdemeanor they bump you off the list for housing um so they're saying they have housing available but they don't my wait time is now over a year from now even though i've been on the list since february um there's nothing available and I've been sleeping in the dirt bugs crawling all over me I have no place to go to the bathroom or wash myself I can't wash myself out in the open I just I have no privacy people have been stealing my stuff people around town I, they hit on me and I kind of get creeped out about that like hey you want to write no thank you um I'm walking around because I have nowhere to go I don't want to ride where would I go do people really see me as less than human I worked all my life. I took care of my mom after her stroke. And that was the hardest job of all, being a mom and taking care of a bedridden person. That's hard. I was happy to do it though. If, if I had anyone in my family who had the resources to help me, I wouldn't be here. I can't imagine handing out tickets to people like me. It's scary. I can't get to court. How am I supposed to get to court? I don't have bus money. I'm glad I was able to say this. You know, what, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Like that, that yucky old roasting pan. It was my mom's. It's the only thing I have left of my mom out here. Someone looks at it and I think, that's garbage, but it's a keepsake. And they look at that pile of stuff out in front of the camp and they think, wow, what a huge load of garbage. Well, it wasn't garbage before the bobcat ran it over and destroyed it. It was people's beds and homes and blankets. You have a coat that will freeze at night. I took my coat. They say there's a big difference between sheltered and unsheltered in the unhoused community. They recognize that unsheltered is a lot worse, a lot more dangerous. And um, that confuses me because why did they destroy my shelter and turn me from a sheltered homeless person to an unsheltered homeless person. And it seems counterintuitive that destroying my shelter, giving me tickets, putting me in jail, that's supposed to help me? It's like, oh, okay, all my medical problems will go away and all my mental health issues will just disappear because you destroyed my shelter and gave me a ticket. Doesn't make any sense to me. When people say there's a terrible homeless problem, what, what do they mean? Um, it's a human tragedy that people are unhoused because of the economy? Or are they saying, I don't like looking at homeless people so get rid of them. But we're not going anywhere. 
our camp was hidden, um, secluded. Now we're all out on the streets. Everyone's gonna have to look at me.